champions, bringing you lowlights in the world of sport. Archery is one of the most ancient of sports. Here is a modern Robin Hood in action. A bullseye, another bullseye, and another, and another. Indeed, a true champion. A favorite indoor sport which requires a steady hand and perfect timing is billiards. Let's watch this difficult shot. Another popular indoor sport. Each winter, ski jumpers from all over the world go to Lake Placid to test their skill. This is considered to be the highest longest and most treacherous ski jump ever constructed. Only those with iron nerve and daredevil courage ever attempt this hazardous feat. And now, about to undertake this perilous jump is Pavo Nervi. Good luck, old man. Happy landing. The high hurdle race is one of the most exciting events of a track and field meet. We're just in time to see the start of the 120 high hurdle race. And they're off. Aquabells get in the swim for the women's national championships. And here's the finish of the 50 yard freestyle race. This attractive miss is the new women's champion. Basil Barracuda, former Olympic star, demonstrates a few swimming strokes. He shows you the breast stroke. And the back stroke. And now the crawl. For grace and beauty, nothing excels perfect dives. This is the jackknife dive. The beautiful swan dive. And here is another very popular dive. Racing is a sport that requires flawless timing and teamwork. Notice their perfect precision. The six-day bicycle race is an annual event at Madison Round Garden. Monotonous, isn't it? Baseball, a national pastime. Let's take a glance at that popular catcher, Gabby Hernet, in action. Come on, old boy, old boy, put it right in there, old kid. Oh, give me old docker right down the middle, old boy, old boy, right in your old groove, old kid. Come on, old boy, old boy, you can't see what old kid puts it right in there, old boy. Little pepper out there, tuck it up there now. Come on, let's go, let's go, not too good. Now. Pitching in there, old kid. Come on, old kid, old kid. Get him in there, Addy, old boy. Let's have him in pick one. That's how old kid. Right down your alley, old boy. Get him in the old boy. Come on, Addy. Put it on top of it. Come on, kid. Come on, put him in there. Come on, let's throw him in there. That's the old pepper in it, kid. Football attracts such capacity crowds that seating has become a problem. Now, here is the latest ideal stadium, the dream of every football fan, where every seat is on the 50 yard line. We go down to the field and show you a few exciting moments from this thrilling game. Signals. 18, 36, 52, 27. Hike. 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 Hike.
Lewis, watch him call it through the center of the line, and there's a pilot. Is it a touchdown? Did he make it? Is it a touchdown? Is it? Mm, yeah, could be. For the benefit of those in the audience who couldn't follow the play, we'll explain it by means of this animated diagram. From a box formation, the backfield shifts into a modified T formation. The left half runs out into the flat zone, the tailback drops back into the left wing position, the quarterback drops back into the tailback position, ball is snapped back to the fullback as the running guard pulls out of the line. The right end takes out the left tackle, left half laterals to the right left wing, left wing laterals to the left halfback, the right half tosses shovel pass against a 2-2 on defense. Tackle takes out the flanker man. Center blocks out the right guard. The center passes the ball. Tackle goes right in. Signal's called. Forward pass to pullback. Left end catches the pass. Fumbles the ball. Center blocks out the guard. Spin through tackle. Quarterback straight arms the end. Run for touchdown. And there you are. And now, the event of events. The Indianapolis Speed Classic. We're in the last lap of this grueling race. Car number 65 is in the lead. Followed by car number 17. And here comes a midget car. And now here comes the winner across the finish line. Let's get a close-up of the victor. Won't you say a few words? 